Let's see. Looks pretty good there. I think we'll uh, just do the intro here. All right. Intro, guys. Intro time, guys. You ready? This is Yu-Gi-Oh! GX Duel Academy. Sitting, sitting by the setting sun. Getting our game on. Welcome back to you, you, yo, G, 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 X, U, Academy, with me, Ledmon, ooh, team, and we're back here with some more Yu Gi Oh G X, the Duel Academy. <laughs> All right, let's do it, guys. Let's get right into the action. So, in between episodes, I kind of just uh, transferred some of the files, and oh, let me. Uh, just in case the recording messes up or anything, let me save a couple states here. Just in case. There we go. Good idea. That way I can always go back if I need to. Uh, it's the draw phase. Uh, it's our turn, right? Oh, we must have scapegoat. Yeah, that's probably it. Yeah, we do. Okay. Alright, switched back to the flood deck for this duel. I'll play a legendary ocean machine. And first turn, Grand Endure! Get out here! Now I play my Swallow Tilt Spike Lizard in attack mode. Uh, and believe it or not, I'm actually not gonna set anything. Maybe we'll see why next turn. Your turn, Fashion! I've already. Oh, uh, wait, let me see if I can do his posh voice. Uh, I've already done the. Oh, let me do it. Let me do a British accent here. I've already done the moth. I will win. <laughs> that was horrible. That was horrible. Need to work on my bastion. Holy smokes. Four face down, son. You are an easy problem to solve, Flood. I activate my face down. Oh. Well, so much for my plan. I was gonna, uh, uh, tribute it for Daedalus, but, uh, he said no to that. Alright. My bastion. Take your damage. Alright. Jarn, that was actually a good move, Bastion. Good move. Uh, let's bait out some magic jammer. Go! Noble bit of extermination! Let's get this one. Uh, no magic jammer, huh? Well, your backup soldier is gone. How many does he have in his deck? I just one? Oh, no! Wait, wait, wait. Yeah, just one, just one. Alright, and uh, we will set scapegoat. Alright, Bastion, you got me. All in my turn. Do, 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 do. Anyway, how are you guys doing today? I'm doing pretty good. Pretty good, can't complain. Beta, huh? That's it? Not even gonna attack me with your face down, huh? I smell a penguin soldier. Do you guys? Reveal scapegoat! Defend my life points. Yeah, this definitely helped us in the last duel. Ah! Works fine for me, Bastion. You had two, you know, probably powerful monster. All I had were some goats, man. All I had were some goats. Works fine for me, buddy. Let's see what he had. Beta and, yep, I called it Flip Monster Man Eater Bug. I knew there was a reason he didn't play that. I'm like, uh, you know. All right, let's uh, play Monster Reincarnation. I know he has one uh, set card left, but I am going to go ahead and discard Giant Trunade to get back Granadora. I think that's... I think it'll be safe. I don't know. I might regret that decision here in a sec. Let's see. Let's see. I summon Granadora. Okay. No trap hole. That's a good sign. Can we attack Bastion? Nice. Nice. Alright, so that face down? Nothing to worry about. No problem. Face down cards? No problem. What you got? You got nothing, son. You got nothing. Now check this move out, Bastion. It's a move I learned from the master of the deep, Mikko Tsunami. Legendary Ocean reduces all the waters in my hand. What? Now you play... What? Wait. 
Why didn't he play that when I played Granadora? Aw, man! I was finally gonna be able to use, uh... Daedalus' effect. I was gonna... Yeah, well, anyway. When Umi's on the field, yeah, you can send it to the graveyard to destroy all cards on the field. Darn it! You know what, Bastion? You outsmarted me. I'll give it to you, buddy. That You actually outsmarted me there. Well played. Well played, sir. My choice just moved. Oh, what's Yeah. Yeah, yeah. It's okay. You're just a theorem to be cracked. Is that so? Well, crack this. I have another Granador in my hand. And now, Bastion, my Granadora will destroy your Force Raider. Go, Swallow Tail Spike Slam. All right, I should reanalyze my formulas. Yes, you should. Hello, Jaden. Hello, Mike. Yes, we analyze those formulas. My choice is maneuvers to summon. Aww, bro. You know what? I do have Snatch Steel. We might be okay here. Aww, yes, calculations, eh? Mm, unfortunately, we will take 2,000 damage here. But we do have Snatch Steel, so can I draw a monster? Yes! Now, bash it! I summon Amphibious Bug Rock MK3 in attack mode. But that's not all, Bastion! Now I use Snatch Steel to take control of your Jinzo! <laughs> Alright, Jinzo, go! Cyber Energy Shockwave! Check your master's life points! Oh, not bad, Flood! Not bad! Man, my Bastion voice is horrible today. Phoebeus Bug Roth in this! It's my deck, Flood! Yes, it is, Flood! I win! 299. Ooh, pretty low points, but that was actually an interesting duel. Heh, I learned, I lost. I learned a lot in this duel. I'll have to recalculate my equations. Yes, yes you will, and I will have to recalculate my Bastion impersonations. That was horrible. Anyway, next duel, Chumley. I know I can do Chumley good. I'm dueling fiery duelists. I totally gotta get sight. This is totally delicious. I'm gonna celebrate with some grilled cheese after this. Hope my kangaroos and koalas are as ready as I am. Yeah, let's do it, buddy. Let's do it. All right, and as you can tell, we have switched back to the flood deck for these next couple of episodes, just to kind of mix it up. Let's do it. Bring your koalas on. Duel. All right, what do we get here? Ooh, Dark Factory Mass Production. That's what I like to see. Got two of them, and Terror King Salmon, and Mama Grizzly. I summon Mama Grizzly. All right, that's it. Go ahead. Let's see what you got, chum. After I win, I'm gonna celebrate with grilled cheese sandwiches. I draw. Time to rock this. Oh, bro. Why you gotta be so cruel? I loved my hand. Uh, well, we could draw something better, though. Delicious. I'll attack with this. Just walk that. All right, Bastion. I'll attack Mother Grizzly with Just Walk that. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Yes, I will special summon. I will take probably Sinister Serpent. That's usually the call in this deck. Yes, I did not draw it. That's good. Get a Sinister Serpent. All right, face downs? Yeah, one face down. All right. So let's see our new hand. Giga 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 Go. The one and only Seven Incredible Fish. Sea Snake. We did get seven tools. That's good. Um, and what does this do? BES Crystal Core, I forget. Let's check it. Let's check the details. Details. Put three counters when you normal summon this. If this card battles, remove a counter. Uh, once return. Oh, right, you can change the positions. Interesting. Wait, 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 wait. Now, this says if it would be destroyed, remove a counter, right? Uh, no, if it battles. This card would. Uh, okay, okay. Um, I'm actually gonna, since he has only one face down, I'm actually gonna play Penguin Soldier and just bounce his hand and try to play around whatever face down he's got there. Now, if he summons on his turn and it's Torrential, I'll let it go through, but... Delicious! I summon this! Nibble manga. Ah, smart. You attack my Sister Serpent first. Good for you, chum. Good for you. You're not a bad duelist after all, you know? All right, Penguin Soldier. Now it's my turn to use Penguin Soldier AI. Let's return this Wombat. 
and let's return your nimble Mamonga. Bye bye. Good to know he has Mamonga though. Ah, good. No more face downs. Good. That's what I like to see. All right, we'll return Sinister Serpent back to my hand. Now let's summon Seven Colored Fish. Uh huh. I got a G when I got a G. I made my face down card delicious. This trap hole. Yep. See. That's why I'm glad that's that's why I didn't tribute summon guys. But I have a trap. Ha, go. Seven tools up the bandit. Keep in America. No, just kidding. But uh, anyway, seven color fish will attack him directly. Let me get a drink of water here. <sighs> alright, alright. Looking good, looking good. I end my turn. What do you got? What do you got? Time to rock this! Uh-oh! Fusion Sage! Is he gonna bring out the Master of Oz? Uh, that's... Mmm... Delicious! I'll attack with this! Death Swamp Bat! Yes, that still is a good card, I must say. Good thing he didn't fuse that turn, though, because if he did... We basically would have lost that turn. Ah, uh, face down. I see that, Bastion. I see that. Hmm, interesting. Maybe I should implore a defensive approach. Because if it's another trap hole, I'll basically lose next turn. So I'll set main of the Aqua and end my turn. Let's see what you do, chum. Delicious. I'll attack with this nibble manga. Good. He didn't tribute summon. That's that's perfect. That's basically exactly what I wanted to happen there. All right. You take 400 damage, and I'll gain another thousand from your set deal. All right, boost my life points. Nice. Okay, now we'll play... Let's try Giant Red Sea Snake. Let's try it. Ah, no trap, huh? Well, let's try attacking. Uh, let's kill the Wombat. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. I got you, I got you. I activate my face down. Mirror Force. Delicious. This destroys all monsters that attack. Yep, good thing I did not... Good thing I went defensive with Main of the Aqua. Delicious! Awesome! And uh oh! Big Koala! Uh oh. Yikes. I'll attack Main of the Aqua with Big Koala! Take down from down under! Delicious! Not good, not good. Now, luckily, we will get another thousand from, uh. Yes, yeah, Snatch Deal. Hmm. This is not good. Uh. Let me think, let me think. Hmm. If I can grab a Snatch Shield of my own, I can take his big koala. And yeah, let's try this. We might lose here, though. I summon Death Koala in attack mode. Depends what he attacks with first. Ooh, yeah. That's gonna hurt. This turn is gonna hurt. We might... Are we gonna lose here? Hang on. Let me take Snatch Shield here real quick. This, uh, yeah. Is this gonna be game? I hope not. Delicious! I gotcha! Grilled cheese is mine! That'll take us to. Ooh! We barely hang on. And we will get an extra thousand from Snatch Steel, so. Ooh! That was close. That was close. Alright. Hmm. Good. And we got Compulse. Alright, so here's what we'll do, guys. With Snatch Steel, I'll take his big koala. Okay. Okay. Attack his desk koala. Main phase two, I'll summon Giga Gaga Gigo. The one and only. Alright. We can do this, guys. We can do this. Big koala, attack desk koala. Take down from down under. How do you like that? And that's not all, chum. In my main phase two, I'll tribute your big koala for the one and only Giga Gaga Gigo. And now I end my turn. What do you get? Hopefully nothing. Yeah, you got nothing. That's right, switch to defense mode, chum. All right. Ah, I see that face down, I see it. I'm done for now. Yeah, you've done plenty, buddy. Got me down to 1100. All right, but we do get a thousand here, which is good. All right. Now, let's try to bait his face down. Maybe it's seven tools. Let's play Compulse on our monster. Come back. Aha! I called it. I gotta do what I gotta do. Seven tools of the bandit. 
All right, all right, that's fine with me. That's fine with me, Chum, because next turn, I'll just gain another thousand life points. So for now, let's set Oi, and let's just see what he's got face down there. It might be Nimomomonga, but let's see. Hyena, hmm, interesting. So he'll be able to special summon a hyena from his deck, right? Yeah. Now, does it have to be an attack position? Uh, no, it does not. Okay. Just checking, just checking. Uh, next turn, though, we're gonna use a special little combo. Let's summon Sinister Sherpa in attack mode. Let's get some good old fashioned bait out here. Alright, what do you. Let's see what you can do, Chimley. Time to rock it up. Uh oh. Oh, wait, wait, wait. We might be able to counter this. We might be able to counter this, guys. In fact, I'm 100% sure we can counter this. Go! Spiritual Water Art Oi! Now your fusion will be useless, Chumley. <laughs> Go! Spiritual Water Art Destroy. Uh, now he has two monsters on the field, right? Let's destroy his big koala. Say goodbye to your big koala, Chumley. <laughs> your fusion is useless if you don't have the materials. Nice! Woo! Spiritual Water Art really came in the clutch there. Man, it would have been over. If he had got that fusion out, it was over, man. GG. Oh, clutch. Clutch. <laughs> man, I feel really good right now. Okay. Well, we got our life points up to 3,100 now, and I know that's the best kangaroo face down, so here's what we're gonna do. Cure Mermaid. Alright. Cure Mermaid will boost our life points if it stays on the field. So I'm gonna finally, at long last, kill our own sinister, uh, seven colored fish. Okay, and I won't kill the hyena because he'll just get to search. So go, giga gaga gigo, destroy that desk kangaroo. All right, and we're looking good now, guys. We're looking good. Got our points back up to 3,100. Next turn, cure mermaid. We'll get him back up some more. Time to rock the up. Uh oh, maybe we're not looking so good. Now, say hello to the terror from down under once again, Big Koala. I attack Cure Mermaid. Oh, man. Ooh, Chemley's bringing the heat this duel. He is bringing it. Man. Uh, not much I can... Ooh, wait, wait, wait. BS Big Core. Oh, is this going to work? Hang on, hang on. Let me, let me check the details. Let me check the details. Is this going to work? Is this going to... Once the turn... You can change one attack position monster to face up defense. 21, and its defense is. Oh, clutch. Clutch. Now I summon my Giga 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 to summon the one and only BS Crystal Core. And I'll activate its effect, Chumley. This will switch your big quality to defense mode. Now it's time to battle. B.E.S. Crystal Core. Attack is Big Koala. Shining Crystal Beacon. Oh, that was perfect. Not delicious. My Big Koala's toast again. Yeah, buddy. Yeah. Down goes your Big Koala, buddy. What are you going to do now? Ah, another face down monster, huh? All right. Whew. Man. We're, every card we have here is coming in clutch now. I think I might set Magician of Faith, because I could get back Snatch Steel. That could help us close it out. Or should I attack? Hmm. Let's play Mad Lobster. Okay. All right, let's attack the Hyena first. Get rid of that. Get rid of the last one in his deck. Let's see if he summons in an attack mode again. Not licious, my Hyena's toast, but I get another one. What? Why didn't he get another one? I'm sorry, what? There's one hyena. I know I destroyed two. Why didn't... Oh! He discarded the other one with card destruction. Perfect. Perfect. This will leave him with no monsters. Perfect. I'm perfect. And we destroyed his panda. Okay. That turn went a lot better than I expected. Okay, because I assumed he was going to summon another hyena, but... We're looking good here, guys. Time to rock this, poison things! Fat load of good, that'll do you, chum. You got no monsters. Alright, time to go for the max damage bonus, guys. Uh, so, BES can get in for one last attack. And let's play... Uh, 
Let's play this on Mad Lobster. Yeah. Okay. And now, let's summon Aquamanure. Alright. Ready for some more deliciousness? Yes, Crystal Core! Crystal Beacon Attack! I should have stayed in bed. Yeah, you should have. Now, Mad Re Lobster, go! Crustacean Claw Slash! Chili Bogus! I want some grilled cheese! Ah, we win. Woo! That was a tough duel, Chemley. Woo! That spiritual water art? Like, dude. If we hadn't played that, we would have lost that duel. Alright, we just... Man, 6-10, that is good points. Yeah, wait, I'm not upset. Dueling isn't all about winning, you know? <laughs> yeah, it is. I mean, win here, win there, win, win, everywhere, where... Alright, guys, with that... Ooh, epic duel. Uh, we're definitely gonna save, but that's gonna be it for t this episode. I will see you all next time. Have a good day.